Whenever the darkness of the night falls, it is wonderful to observe the tiny lights that flicker in the surroundings. It looks like a little fire that flies and decorates the leaves of the trees and plants, which gives a very beautiful view. These are the fireflies that rain every night and dance in the wind. They give light to the darkness around them, particularly during the night of summer. Fireflies also known as lightning bugs, are insects that have a so-called bioluminescent pigment. This is the reason why an animal has light, and fireflies are one of a kind, and there is no need for heat just to produce light. The light of fireflies can be seen on the lower part of its abdomen, and it flashes not completely but every few seconds during the night. Light flashes by sending signals from the brain. That's why we can see them flashing light on and off, depending on how much light their body requires. The light that comes from fireflies is what they use to communicate with other flies, or to guard their own territories. Mostly fireflies flashlight to attract mates and it will be answered by turning on the light of other flies which are closely nearby. At this point, breeding of fireflies occurs. After a few days of pregnancy, the fireflies lay their eggs on a plant somewhere in a safe place. The eggs will soon hatch and grow into a larva and will provide food on their own. These larvae feed on snails and slugs, which is beneficial to farmers in exterminating pests. At this stage, the larva fireflies begin to glow so early. Their bioluminescence markings can be seen beside their long bodies and they grow to another phase of their life. One amazing and strangest thing about fireflies is the way they transform into adults. They pupate in a safe place such as dugout soil or tree trunks. They stay there for several days until they transform to adults. Today, we often see no more fireflies during the night. Their population drops fewer and fewer because of pesticides, insecticides and any other harmful chemicals which are toxic to them. We also can't see them in the city or crowded places because it is too bright and noisy, which causes them to migrate to quieter places. Often, they can only be found in isolated households, forests, mountains, and meadows.